He has been blind since birth, but that hasn't stopped a young man from Farmingdale from playing his way to the top. I caught up with Danny Keene, and we spoke about overcoming the obstacles that stand in your way. To say Danny Keene of Farmingdale can do just about anything on the piano would be an understatement. Check out this rock star performance. To your basic classical piece. But the one thing he won't do is use his disability as a crutch. You see, this piano player is blind. I've learned to take pride in it, that it makes you who you are, and that uh, you almost don't want to know what you'd be like without it. Danny has been blind since birth. He suffers from Libra's congenital amaurosis, a rare hereditary disease. In a nutshell, it's the absence of vision. He was given a piano at the age of two at a doctor's suggestion, and it's been off to the races ever since. Once I, I started hearing music that I liked, I became like my own private teacher, student, uh, obsessed fan. I just really grabbed it. I can't even see my family. The walls in his room are like a tribute to the musical greats, including Prince, Jimi Hendrix, and Ray Charles. But he'll be the first to tell you growing up blind has not always been easy. And the way people perceive you, he says, can be frustrating. You feel that people don't see you as a complete human being. I feel like people um, might look at you as a little less or, or either like you have to be super blind man or helpless blind man. And it's like, what if you're just a blind man? What if you're just a blind lady? What if you're just deaf? What if, you know, it, it's, it's very, um, you, you feel like you always have to prove something. His mother, Colleen, had a fight with the Farmingdale school system. Well, our district never had a totally blind child before, and we just needed him to learn Braille and have all his books and dittos brailled, and that was the struggle. Getting around Long Island is not easy for a blind person. He cites simple things like taking a walk. So those right on reds, it can be confusing. Yeah, of course. They, I mean, it's, it's made with pedestrians not in mind unless you're out in like Montauk or something. But that's, you know, that's the situation. It's, it is what it is, and I, I ain't mad about it. So you just got to adapt. Walking by himself on the island he feels can sometimes lead to the unexpected. Like Very much in handy. See? There ain't nothing I can do about that. I got my hair combed by some leaves. <laughs> but it's okay. Danny got national attention when he finished in the top 30 on American Idol's first season. Mama takes bad for me. I joined him playing this Bob Dylan tune as we went to a terrain he can see as clear as day. Music. He has a message for kids who are blind and might be having a tough time. Learn to respect yourself and people will treat you the way you let them treat you. And if you demand respect by giving respect and by accepting nothing less than, you can really find your way to be whatever you're trying to be. And if I could do it, anybody could. Mom has one for parents. My best advice is to let your child become who they are, just like your other children. I write the song. I hope you want to hear. I play some music. Put it right in your ear. If you don't know by now, I'll introduce myself. My name is Danny King, right here on News 12. Ooh. 
If you'd like to see more of my interview with Danny Keene, just turn to channel 612 on your digital cable box and click on IO Extra.